What's going on YouTube? Critical Ray back here again and today I'm going to be doing my review for Solo A Star Wars Story. Now this movie has a runtime of 2 hours and 15 minutes. It stars Alden Enrich, uh, Woody Harrelson, Amelia Clark, Donald Glover, and Jonas Suatomo, Suatomo as uh, Chewie. I'm, I'm saying that because I didn't know that there was a new guy playing Chewbacca in this movie. Uh, this movie was directed by Ron Howard. It was written by Jonathan and Lawrence Kasdan. And the basic synopsis, because this is a non-spoiler review, I will not give any spoilers for this movie. Uh, this is a origin story of the best smuggler in the galaxy and how he meets his co-pilot and best friend. Uh, and I'm sure from the trailers you know there's a little bit more to that, but I'm going to keep it bland for that synopsis. Uh, now, I did not have any hopes into going into this movie. None of the trailers interested me. Like, I was like, okay, a new Star Wars movie's coming out. It's about Han Solo. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that new guy playing Han Solo. It's going to be real, you know, they can't really try anything new. I kind of knew that they weren't going to try anything new with his character, that it would just be someone playing, like, trying to act like Harrison Ford as Han Solo. And, yeah, he does that, but he also kind of makes it his own with some of the things that he does and, like, the facial expressions and emotions that he can do. And it was nice. Uh, yeah, I did not have any expectations going into this, and I really enjoyed it. This is a great Star Wars movie. It is a great entry into the saga. Uh, way better than Rogue One, for sure. Uh, the action was great. Um... I mean, it was just really well done. It was nice to see, because it's a heist movie, so it was nice to see heist and like stuff like that, and just the set pieces along with the action and stuff like that. It was just, it was phenomenal. The cinematography, well done. Uh, yeah, because there's a lot of stuff that could have went wrong with this movie, and they did a really good job about it. Um, the acting was good. Amelia Clark was great as, um, I don't remember her name. I don't. But she was great her, as her character. Uh, I also feared that, like, her, because she's the love interest for Han Solo, and I kind of feared that it wouldn't work or it'd be, like, a really slow point. But it really wasn't, so that was a nice surprise for me. Uh, Woody Harrelson as... Han's mentor, or whatever you want to call him, uh, he was good. He was very entertaining. I mean, he was just Woody Harrelson. He's a great actor altogether. Uh, Don Glover as Lando Carrissian was great. I mean, I couldn't imagine anyone else playing him. He's got the charisma and everything. It was just great. And then John Sutema as Chewie. I mean, he does a good job as Chewie, and it's nice. Um, yeah, uh, the story overall was great. I love seeing stuff about, like, how him, Han, and Chewie met. I didn't really know anything about that. It was nice to see uh, more of Han's past and actually know what he's gone through and stuff like that to get to the point where he is and when A New Hope comes around. But that being said, I do have some cons with this. It's not very many. It's just one. Uh, at times, to me, the pacing seemed off. At times, more towards the beginning is when it really kind of felt off. Uh, but it fixed itself real fast. Uh, and that could have been to the fact that they've had a couple of directors come on and some of them did some stuff and then Ron Howard came on and ultimately is the credited director. I don't remember the other guy's name. I think there was two other directors. But if y'all know in the comments, let me know down below and tell me, you know, what all happened. I didn't really keep up with it, like, reading and stuff like that, because I was just going to see the end product. Um, yeah, so overall, Solo A Star Wars Story is a really fun and good entry into the saga. You can enjoy this one. You know, go into it knowing that it's not Harrison Ford. It's a new character, and they're going to add to his backstory, but they can't really, like, do any emotion stuff and things like that to the character where it 
is going to mess up like how he would react in A New Hope and Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi. All of those interactions have to still make sense. So they had a very tough job to do, and I think they did a great job with it. So I am going to give Solo a Star Wars story an A. Comment down below and let me know if y'all seen this one, what y'all thought of it, if you're going to see it this weekend. And yeah, um, in the description I'll have links to my Instagram, Twitter, Facebook page for the channel. Click on over there to get updates on like what I'm doing, what I'm seeing, stuff like that, personal life stuff even. And yeah, uh, like the video if you did, share it with all your friends, family, everyone that you know, and even people that you don't know. And subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Goodbye.